This poem was inspired by a small footnote I read on a Wikipedia page about Christopher Columbus, about how he had two parrots that he brought back from the Caribbean to Spain. And so this is the poem, The Inquisitor's Parrots. When Columbus returned to Spain, he gifted two parrots to Queen Isabella. History cannot tell us how long it took until the birds had forgotten the language of the Taino they mimicked on the island. And if the Spaniards ever registered those sounds as distinct words or assumed they were meaningless squawks. We do not know if the sailors, tired of hearing the parrots screech for home, stowed them deep in the brig where they slept a four-month night, or if they bonded with their captors, perched on their shoulders, and learned the Spanish tongue. There are no records of their lives in Spain, or what they witnessed in the royal councils. We do not know if they were bribed with olives to teach them to shriek, Rap! Otto de fe! Otto de fe! As the condemned was mortified before the crowd, or if the parrots themselves ended their lives on the braziers, having revealed too much.